My name is Angelo, and welcome to We Want Picks. I'm going to break down my favorite Monkey Knife Fight knockout king's entry for UFC Vegas 64. If you don't know what Monkey Knife Fight is, it's daily fantasy. And for the most part, you just say more or less on the numbers you see on the screen. But we're going to play one of their games called Knockout Kings, where you can pick any three fighters on the entire card. And if one of them, just one out of three, wins by KO or TKO, you get paid. Two, you get paid even more. Three, you get paid even more. Go to weonpicks.com slash MKF. They will instantly match your deposit. So sign up now using promo code WWP and get that free money. If you give them 50, they'll give you 50. If you give them 100, they will give you 100. Take that free money. Play one of these Knockout King entries. And if you win, you have even more free money. If you lose, it's okay. It was their money. You still have all of yours and we'll get them next week. Let's go ahead and just click on slates. Fire our way to the bottom and build our Knockout Kings entry. These are all different strike line slates. And you can jump in there and watch our full card breakdown where we break down these strike lines and, and how we think they're going to go. Right now, we're just going to focus on Knockout Kings. So any three fighters that can win by KO or TKO. You get a wrestler with elbows, TKO. So first of all, Mario Batista. He's fighting a dude who's coming back after three years, a guy who's been stopped before, a very dangerous fighter, but three years away, he's a real estate agent now. I think Mario Batista can absolutely get this stoppage win. A lot of people like Miranda Maverick here. My concern is I think she'll get a submission instead of a TKO. Uh, then we have Tagir Ulenbekov. If you think he's going to get the takedowns and the elbows, then you can go Tagir. Ludovic Shalinian, same boat. Johnny Munoz was just put to sleep. Jake Hadley potentially, but Carlos Candelario is very tough. We've got a couple of heavyweights that you can jump on. And then we have, you know, this card opener here. But let's scroll back up. I like Shalilan Nerdenbeek. I think he's going to come in, get the takedowns, beat him up. He throws heat on his feet. He elbows on the ground. I think Shalilan's going to get the stoppage here, and I think um, he's a safe play for knockout kings. And then the last, one, the last one is dealer's choice. I never chase three. You still need to throw three people in here, but I'm never chasing three, so I'm just trying to build a cushion. And, you know, frankly, it's this is a tricky card because there's not a lot of guys that are just wild throw heat power type guys. But I think Ludovic Shalinian is, is probably one of the safer plays here. But you can throw anybody you want in that third slot. I think Ludovic, you know, can get the takedowns, can get the elbows, can make stuff happen. He may not, but he can. So I'm going to go Ludovic Shalinian here. He's a decent striker, can make something happen. Shalilan Nerdenbeek throws heat with every punch and grapples. Mario Batista can submit you, can knock you out, can beat you up for three rounds. So one of these guys should win by KO or TKO. We did miss last week with Waldo. You know, he, he worked, he came forward, he tried to do it, but all of a sudden Jared Vander is the leg kick king and his head held, you know, his chin held up. But anyway, build your entry. We want picks.com slash MKF. Sign up, make your deposit, let them match it using promo code WWP. Take that free money and play some of these lines, build this Knockout Kings entry.